be it's the end of the game of 2000 and today we are doing the challenge where we get dispose of Sylvie's Crusoe's body in um, um, a garden shredder. So anyway, first you're going to go to the left through here and this uh, to this delivery van. And you're going to just take out this guy here. But take his disguise before you uh, throw him over the edge. Like this. And then, you know, just throw him over the edge. Um, what you're going to want to do as well, uh, well, first go around and get the flowers, and you'll you'll want to drop your gun. I didn't hear because I just wanted to show an example of what would, ha well, not what would happen, but if you still have your gun in uh, in your pocket, then uh, it'll show a red exclamation mark when you're gonna get frisked here. If you, so, sorry, yeah, you know, if you um see here, you can see a red exclamation mark on the place where it says get frisked so I uh, went back here to go uh, to go uh, drop the gun because otherwise you know they'll start killing you because you have a gun on you and stuff like that yeah don't climb up here but anyway you're gonna get frisked then it's fine to do that as long as you don't have any weapons that can um like get seen in the frisk yeah if it doesn't have an exclamation mark on the get frisked thing, then that means you're fine. You're not gonna get spotted. So yeah, don't press X to knock them out of, of as well because you're just gonna yeah have a bad time completing this challenge. So then you're gonna go into the uh, mansion. Well, uh, and there's um, a butler. Make sure you've got the um, flowers in hand. A voice will say to get them. Okay, yeah, so just talk to him. He uh, does say to follow him. He does say to follow him to the uh, grave to drop the flowers there. But uh, well, it's just quicker if because he, he goes slow, so it's just quicker if you do it on your own. But yeah, just go where I go. So go through here and then uh, to the left. And then uh, down these steps. Down these steps. Sorry. And then down here, and uh, place the flowers on the grave. If you've got time to spare, like me, uh, then well, if they're already there, then don't do it. But um, uh, hide in this uh, crate here. Oh, sorry, someone's ringing me. Don't worry about that. Um, so just hide in the crate and wait until Sylvia um tells his guards to go away and they go away, and then uh, uh they'll be um. Yeah, and then he'll like be at the grave. When he's like close to the grave, that's when you're gonna go and kill him. It doesn't matter how you kill him. I uh, just snapped his neck, but I yeah, know you. There's a screwdriver in your bike, you're gonna kill him with that. But you know, I'm just boring. I just snapped his neck, but oh well. Okay. Yeah. You don't have to wait too long. Last time I tried this, like he came pretty quick, but for some reason it took a while this time. Okay. Yeah, don't get out until uh, he's like in the opposite direction and like close to the grave over he'll see you then like spot you and ask your guards to go check you out and stuff like that, you know. All the bad stuff that happens when you're spotted. Yeah. So just wait. Shouldn't be too long. Yeah. So the guards are gone now. Uh, well, like leaving. Don't get out yet. Wait until he gets like right up close to the grave, uh, like that. Yeah, that's the pose. And then, yeah, then you can exit. it. And then, well, I think you have to. I don't know if there's a certain pose the people uh, over at the ruins have to be looking at, but um, well, they didn't spot it when I dragged it. So, just drag it past there and into the garden shred over here. You have to get not. You have to not be spotted doing it, and that's pretty easy to do. So, anyway, dump him in there, and then shred the body. And anyway, well, thanks for watching the video. I'll see you in the next um video. Um, goodbye. Just being.